Morgan here for One Infinity, and today we're going to be cutting this Team One Infinity sign using the test cut file that was preloaded on your One Infinity CNC. You should have also gotten one of these already cut, packaged with your machine when it was delivered. A lot of folks don't actually know this, but the sign that you got was actually cut by your machine using the preloaded test file. Every One Infinity CNC is fully assembled, tested, and checked for quality before leaving our facility. If this is your first time operating a CNC, this should give you a good feel on how to load a program position and secure material, and get comfortable with the order of operations. It'll be second nature in no time. First thing you need to know is the size of the test piece. The G-code will cut this sign about four inches by 10 inches. I recommend using a test piece no smaller than six inches by 12 inches and three quarters of an inch thick. Next thing you need to know is that you need a quarter inch diameter spiral bit. A down cut bit will give you a cleaner cut than an up cut bit. It's not really important for this test, but just keep that in mind for the future. Open the test cut file on the touch display. Place the 3-axis touch probe on the corner of the test piece closest to the machine's home position and probe for X, Y, and Z. This lets the machine know where your material is within the machine's cutting area. Confirm that the bit is 6.35 millimeters in diameter, that's just a quarter inch in cilial metric. When you hit the play button to run the program, it'll first ask you to change the bit and probe for Z. I already installed the bit I needed, so I had to create a diversion to distract the machine for a few minutes. What's that? Did you change my bit? Totally. Yeah, totally. With the bit sitting about a quarter inch over the touch probe, hit continue. The program will start with a Z call, and we'll again set the Z axis before cutting anything. Once the machine probes for Z, remove the touch probe, return to your point of origin, fire up the router, and hit continue. Now just sit back, relax, and watch the magic. Now remove the test piece and display it prominently in your shop to show everyone you're one of the cool kids. And that's it. For more tips and tricks, subscribe to the channel and be sure to hit that notification bell. I hope this was helpful and I hope to see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Y'all be good.